How's it going, peeps? Welcome back to the channel. If you're new to the channel, we cover the backstories of comic book characters, especially those coming to or rumored to be coming to live action. So click that subscribe button and turn on the notifications so you don't miss out on any backstories of your favorite comic book characters. In case you didn't see the spoiler warning on the thumbnail, I'm letting you know now. In this video, we will cover things about Duplicate that have not happened in the Invincible show yet. So if you don't want to know, time for you to go. Get the hell out! Get out! Get out! Get out! Okay. Get out! Get out! Now with that said, let's find out who is Duplicate. Duplicate's true name is Kate Cha. She has the ability to create identical duplicates of herself at will. Each duplicate contains the same mass as the original. She has been able to produce as many as 100 duplicates at one time. Each of her duplicates have independent thoughts and actions, although they are linked to the original Kate telepathically. Initially, Kate faced a moral dilemma when learning to control her powers and having to eliminate the copies of herself. But she soon realized that the duplicate's memories were all linked to her alleviating the moral reservations she had to eliminating the copies. Her duplicates remain in existence as long as she wills them to. When the need for their assistance no longer exists, she can will them out of existence and they are reabsorbed. Kate also possesses training in Muay Thai, kickboxing, jiu-jitsu, taekwondo, and western boxing. Centuries ago in China, a warlord named Feng Cha killed the country's emperor and claimed the throne for himself. As the emperor died, he bestowed a curse upon Feng Cha that the seventh generation after his seventh grandchild would be overbearing by family and go crazy. Hundreds of years later, the appointed grandchild would be Sing Cha. His wife gave birth to Kate and her brother Paul and died shortly after childbirth. This left Sing to raise the two children on his own. When the two became toddlers, they began multiplying, creating identical copies of themselves. Unable to stop it, Sing was driven insane. He was placed in an institution and the two were placed in state care. They were examined by medical professionals and scientists to try and determine the cause of the powers and how they worked. As the two hit puberty, they were able to control their powers and learn to generate and reabsorb their duplicates at will. The two became a crime fighting team together, Duplicate and Multipol. The two worked together until Kate joined the teen team. She served with the team for four years. At some point, she began a relationship with teammate Rex Blow behind Adam Eve's back. A short time after Robot informed the team they would soon disband, Eve caught Rex and Kate together. Kate and Rex remained a couple after Eve broke it off. Kate and Rex later joined the new Guardians of the Globe. Some of the more notable missions she was involved in were defeating the Flaxen and capturing Machine Head. She broke off her relationship with Rex after she caught him cheating. She and the Immortal then began dating. The Immortal and Kate eventually got married. They had a private wedding and afterwards let their friends know. Duplicate and Immortal continued on being heroes. So what do you think about Duplicate? Let me know all your thoughts down in the comments. There are more Invincible character backstories on the channel. Go check them out. As always, I appreciate you taking the time out of your busy day to stop by the channel and check out my videos. Please like, share, and subscribe. We'll see you again real soon. I'm Audi. Peace.